Imagine you could communicate with your audience while presenting in Canva. Now stop imagining. Hi, I'm Hadass and welcome to Tip Talk. In this episode, I'd like to introduce to you Canva Live. When presenting with Canva, you can encourage your audience to ask you questions while you are presenting by using Canva Live. With Canva Live, you can see questions and comments that come in from your audience and answer them and interact. This feature is available to Canva Pro, Canva for Enterprise, Canva for Education, and Canva for Nonprofits users. So let's see how we do that. So your first step would be to open your Canva presentation. I have here an 18 page template that I took from the template bank and now let's click on present at the top bar here. Once I'm inside the presentation mode, you will notice down here that you have the option of crowdsourcing questions from your audience with Canva Live. Once I click on that, I get this window on the right to open my Canva Live session. To start a new session, just click on this and we're live. All we need to do now is ask our audience to visit canva.live on their device and enter the code given to us. This is a six digit code that is unique to every session. And now let's see this happen in real time. Oh, and there we get our first comment. This is so exciting. Now everyone in this session can see this comment, unless I wish to hide it. At the top right corner, I have this hide option that once clicked, the comments are hidden. If I want to show them again, I just click on show and it pops up again. When I click on these three dots, I can highlight this comment and display this as a bigger comment. Ooh, this is so exciting. I can also delete the message or just click once again and display it smaller. I can continue moving with my slides and this window on the right will stay there unless I hide it. And now I see that I have a new comment from Dan. Will you show us some videos? I can answer this as I go along and continue with my presentation. If I want to end this live session, all I have to do is just go up here to the top right corner and click on end. This will end the session and if I would like to start a new one, all I have to do is repeat. Click on start new session. Do notice that you will be assigned a new code that your audience will have to re-enter. Now let's see what it looks like from the audience experience. So let's go to our browser and type in canva.live. Now enter a code to connect. That's it, we're in. Now let's type our comment. And we can enter our name, this is optional, you don't have to. And once we click on send, there it is. You can also use live reactions by going to the bottom right corner and clicking on this heart. You can then pick any reaction that you want and this will automatically appear on the screen while presenting. One important thing to know is that this also works with a presenter view mode. The questions and comments that come in will only be shown on the presenter view window. That's it. How fun was that? That's it. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this episode and I'll see you in the next Tip Talk. As always. Wow. Thank you, Adas, for these precious tips. And thank you for watching this video until the end. I have two playlists right here for those of you who want to go a bit deeper and keep learning. This one right here is a collection of step-by-step -step Canva tutorials. And this one gathers all of our Canva Space webinar recordings where Canva experts teach about all sorts of topics.